Hi, welcome to volunteering at House of Friendship. My name is Sandra. I've been volunteering for about six years. I love working on the turkey trucks because I love to meet the people that come and pick up the turkeys. We hear great stories. We meet great people. Uh, it's really a lot of fun. The volunteers get to have a lot of fun because we get to hang out together. We look forward to having you come out and join us and uh, hang out and hand out the turkeys. Thank you. Thank you for volunteering to deliver turkeys this year. This short video will provide you with a little bit of information about your role and House of Friendship. At House of Friendship, we walk alongside those who need food, housing, community resources, or addiction treatment. House of Friendship is committed to serve in four strategic areas as shown on the screen here. We value each person's unique journey and experience. We don't hand out answers, we pause and listen, working with individuals and families to connect them to the resources that will help them thrive. We walk together with them as a partner on their personal journey, opening doors to choice and possibility. Hi, I'm Jim Erb. I'm a longtime volunteer with the House of Friendship and a member of the Kitchener Conestoga Rotary Club. Our Rotary Club for the last number of years has taken the leadership in raising the funds to supply the food products for the hampers that the House of Friendships delivers for their Christmas hamper program. The hampers include, of course, a turkey, some fresh food, and a gift card to make Christmas much more enjoyable for families in our community. 1,200 volunteers help make this happen, and it's a really simple concept, sharing the gift of food, which I hope you will join us in doing. On the screen here, you'll see the addresses for the Kitchener and the Waterloo trucks. The Kitchener truck is at the Kitchener Legion, and the Waterloo truck is at Waterloo Pentecostal Assembly. Please arrive at your assigned location on time. If you're running late or need to cancel your shift, please email volunteering at houseoffriendship.org. On the screen here, you will see what the turkey trucks look like. The turkeys are all stored in that gray herb truck, which you can access using the platform. Supplies are stored in the black trailer. You will be outside or working in a freezer truck for the entire length of your shift. Dress in warm clothes with hats and mittens. Even if it seems like a warm winter day, it will feel cold after two hours outside. Here are a few other things that you should consider. Please wear flat, anti-slip footwear. Winter boots are often best. We recommend that you leave your valuables in your car. There will be a bathroom on site for you to access. All volunteers should be 15 years or older. Children under 15 can attend a volunteer shift with an adult, but must be supervised by an adult at all times. Here's a little bit of information about how to distribute a turkey. Each person who received a food hamper also got a voucher to receive a turkey. When the participant hands you a voucher, please provide one turkey. You do not need to ask for identification or a signature stating that they picked up their turkey. Please put all vouchers in the bag provided. If someone comes to the turkey truck without a voucher, for example, they've lost or forgotten it, please offer him or her a ham. Families are able to pick up for other families. For example, if someone has two vouchers, please provide him or her with two turkeys. Halal turkeys are available for anyone who requires it. If the participant mentions that they have a large family, for example, six or more, offer a ham in addition to a turkey. We have aluminum cooking pans available for anyone that needs it. Please offer one pan per family and a recipe card. Put the meat in a cloth bag for easy transportation. And upon request only, offer one bus ticket per person. I'm now going to talk a little bit about your responsibilities as a volunteer. You are an ambassador for House of Friendship while you are volunteering. Please represent us in a positive way. Be sure that you are familiar with our mission found at the beginning of this video so that you can speak accurately and confidently about House of Friendship. There will be information for you to refer to on site. If anyone requires additional information that you are unable to provide, please direct them to our website. When you arrive for your shift, you will be greeted by the Turkey Truck Supervisor, who will be a House of Friendship staff member. Your supervisor will orient you to your role and make sure that you are comfortable. He or she will not remain at the site for your entire shift, but will provide you with a phone number to call if any issues arise. The turkeys are all stacked at the back of the freezer truck. To ensure the distribution goes smoothly and quickly, please bring some turkeys to the front of the truck and place them in a bag. Frozen turkeys can be heavy, and if they fall on you, you will get hurt. 
Do not drop them on the floor of the truck. If they are too high for you to reach, please call your supervisor for help. Throughout your shift, make sure that the platform and the area where the public walk on is clear of snow and ice. Make sure you close the freezer truck when you are not in it to maintain the cold temperature that is required. When you are nearing the end of your shift, count the vouchers that you have collected and record the total on the spreadsheet provided. We use this information to plan for next year. You are free to take pictures during your shift. However, be careful not to get any pictures of people who are coming to get their turkey. We want to ensure the privacy of everyone and ensure that they are able to receive their turkey with dignity. I'm now going to talk a little bit about health and safety. It's important that you work in a safe manner whenever you are volunteering for House of Friendship. Use caution when lifting or moving turkeys. Repetitive movements can hurt your back or shoulders. Take breaks often when moving the turkeys or rotate rolls with your team. Be very careful when walking on snow and ice. Keep your center of gravity over your feet and walk like a penguin. Extend your arms to your sides to keep your balance and keep your knees loose. We have attempted to ensure adequate lighting is available for late afternoon and evening shifts. Make sure you turn on all lights when it starts to get dark. Be aware of your surroundings and keep yourself safe. If you need any help with a situation that you encounter, please do not hesitate to call your supervisor or 911 if required. I'm now going to speak a little bit about confidentiality. Any information that you learn about the people who are receiving a turkey should remain confidential. Even the fact that an individual or family received a turkey should not be shared with anyone. Confidentiality can only be broken if you suspect that someone is at risk to themselves or someone else. This should be reported to House of Friendship. Each person that receives a turkey from House of Friendship is a unique person and their individuality should be respected. It is important that you don't pass judgment. Thank you for your help distributing turkeys. Today you are providing the gift of food to each person that you distribute a turkey to. Thanks to you, a single dad who is struggling to feed his young family will have a special meal to share over the holiday season. A breadwinner who just lost her sole source of income will have food to put on the table and individuals and families can celebrate the holidays without worrying about where their holiday meal will come from. Feel free to take any pictures of your turkey distribution crew and post on social media using the hashtag StrongerTogether. Thanks to you, we are StrongerTogether.